Apfel Doctor Germany. My name is Ben, and today we do a repair together iPhone 7 Plus um, with no boot, no function, and the customer needs his important data, so he mailed it in, and um, we will have a look what is going up with this device. Okay. I give you on hands. Short story, yesterday some burglars stole my e-bike. My e my e-bike fat bike. Yeah, <laughs> now it's gone. <laughs> and uh, I have to walk now. Yeah, in a small city with about 2,500 uh, people who live here. On USB M meter, we got about 370 milliamps. I'm sorry, unless you're good. That's what in the English. Yeah. You always have to laugh, and uh, if your family is fine and your kids are good, it's not bad. So if the, the burglar is, uh, is looking at this video, uh, I wish you a nice ride. <laughs> Nice ride on a four thousand dollar e bike. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's get the screen off. Yeah. Ah, we got something new here. Um, give me, please, this uh, what I gave to you. Andy. Ah, I got it here. It's okay. We got the new Quan Li. Um, curved screen disassembler here. Let's have a look if it works. It's nice, it's really, really thin. So now open the device and let's hook it up to the DC power supply. Um, this paste I got today from Union Repair for test. Normally I only use the PPD 183. Let's have a look for iPhone X if this paste is okay. Normally I don't use mechanic ones, so let's get it a try. Okay, hook it up to the power supply to see what we have here. Okay, we have a short. Let's have a look. Yeah, we have a short about 600 milliamps. Great, take out the board. Look by thermal cam. Find the short, remove the short and the phone is back to life again and all the data will be safe. What about that? Should we do that together? Oh, I didn't do any Instagram today. Followers will be, will be angry. Here yeah, people, a lot of work today, so not much story until now. Uh, what I do now is iPhone 7 Plus, no boot, and short at about 700 milliamps. Have a look, I will post some pictures and do a YouTube video. Somebody wrote under one of my last videos, a German, um, um, why I don't speak any German in the videos and uh, if um, Union Repair pays me money for speaking English in videos, my friend. Um, I only knew Sven from Union Repair, he's the boss. And I don't get any money or any things from them for doing some English videos. It's just about that we have over 300 videos in German language and uh, Actually, we do in English videos, so more people can see and understand the videos clearly. And the English-speaking people give me just more love than the Germans. 
It's always the same. The Germans, Germans are most most of the Germans are not good people, in my opinion, because they often. I don't know how to say. In English, it's a night culture here in Germany. Okay, and that's bad. I will do some German videos. Uh, yeah, that's no problem. But please show some respect. Therefore, that I'm actually doing English videos to to show some more people what we do here. Okay, Germany is small. It's a small small country. And I've done so many videos. I got about 600,000 uh, clicks only with videos in Germany. So let's let's do a little bit bigger and reach more people to show them what we what we can do here. That's the that's the thing. And I don't think that it's bad to make videos in English because most of the Germans speak English too. They learn it at school. And so you can learn some bad English from me too. It's okay or not, Andy? As always, Andy doesn't listen to me. Okay, now the last screws. Then taking out the board. Okay, here we are. Peel off the stickers. stickers do visual inspection perhaps we can see something now oh it's it's a rainbow colored one oh what's that what's that here on the bottom do you see that looks like corrosion under the here, do you see that? It's corrosion. On the backlight I see is here on the backlight I see is on the LCD I see it's corrosion. Yes. What the customer writes? He doesn't write anything about corrosion or about water. Nothing. What about the water markers? They aren't. Here we can see a little bit of water, but the markers are okay. Let's have a look at the top. Let's have a look at the top looks good but this is not normal you see that we check by thermal we check by thermal you will see the thermal image on the in this video Somebody writes, oh je, ich habe gelesen, dass irgendwo ein Fahrrad gefunden worden ist. Stand im Gebüsch. Oh no. But I say it's away. 
it never comes back to, back to Spike. So let's have a look on Thermal Imager. We could now move away the corrosion and uh, things like that, but first I want to have a look where the where the heat comes from. So I go directly to this uh, to this point. Oh, it's VDD boost. Do you see that? It's wonderful. It's a short on VDD boost and you see the cap crate. On thermal imager crate. The corrosion on the on the bottom must be longer. I will move it away, but here you can see the problem. Here you can see the problem. The problem is this cap. This is the one and only thing we have to to change, to replace, and then the phone will work fine again. So let's have a look at ZXW. To see the value of the cap. I think about 10 or 15 microfarad on 6.3 6 volt. This is what I think. Yeah, it is. I can show to you window capture. Okay. So, this is the one. VDD boost. Should, should be good. Okay. And I had exactly, exact the same fault today morning on an iPhone 7 and it was this cap. It's really, 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 really ill. Sick, it's really sick. I think we have to say really sick. That uh, things like this happens twice a day. Exactly the same thing. Hard. So short must be away. Um, just need my, uh, my fluke. Short is gone. The new cap. New cap here. Im linken Schrank müssen die eigentlich sein. Wenn nicht, sind sie drüben im Lager. Okay, we are done. New cap. And now we should have a function on this phone again. Check. Let's check for function. I think the, the water contact was a long time ago. The phone worked anyway, and this here is a complete different damage, which is solved now. 
and the phone will boot up again and work again. Yeah, here's the apple, it close and we are back to life again. Like I always say. And tell them that we use original clue. Yeah? Okay, that's it. Just wait some seconds and the boot will be ready. Yeah, here we are, full function. Just have to get up the works again. Okay, I will just clean the corrosion on the bottom, and um, then I will do the clue stickers on the board, clean everything, and assemble the phone. So we got a full functional phone again, and a happy customer more. Okay. This was all what I wanted to show you. Fast repair iPhone 7 Plus short on VDD Boost. Um, found by using thermal cam. Change the cap. Bam. Back to life again. I'm out. We see us in the next video. Yours, Ben. Ah, if you like to learn things like that, you can come to the board level Repair School Germany. And um, if you are technician, if you are uh, technician in repair industry, if you are seller of goods for repair industry, you can come to our Facebook group, Smartphone Repair Group Germany. I'm out. Goodbye.